excuse me. Uh, not now. It was pointless trying to get... Can I ask you something? If you... What does it do? Your guess is as... Is Nave a good... De He's as good a detective... You light on your feet, Lane? Do I look... Is there anything else you're not telling me, Mr. Lane? Get lost. Changed your opinion of Moo? Who? Moo. Who? Never mind. Okay. Th yes, yes. Inspector Nave. I know this sounds obvious, but are you sure it's plugged in? Monsieur Stobart, do you really think I would be so stupid as to not check the fundamentals? We all make mistakes. What a ridiculous generalization, monsieur. Look, I can see from here it's... Ah. Do you need assistance, sir? Very funny, more. One moment. That got rid of him. Now is my chance. I was going to have to figure that out quickly. Time to get the show on the road. See, Mu? I knew I would get it working. I'm not sure that you... Precisely. You knew my superior intellect would win through in the end. Yes, sir. Sir, I beg your pardon, but I think there is a teeny snag. Go. Go on. We have no victim. Good God, Mu. Are you suggesting I kill someone for the sake of this reenactment? No, sir. Just saying we need a body, sir. Ah, yes. I see. You will make a detective yet, Mu. I, of course, foresaw this. And I nominate... You. Me? Well, I'm not dead. Have you ever acted, Monsieur Stabart? Well, I <laughs> don't like to blow my own trumpet, but I went down a storm playing the lead in Cat on a Felt-Tip Roof last summer. Hmm. You played the cat? Uh, no. So, not the lead. half truths again, Monsieur. Nevertheless, here is your chance to play a real lead role. But he looks nothing like the victim, sir. Oh, damn it, Moo. Must you find problems all the time? Let me think of a way to make this work. Relying on Nave's problem-solving skills could mean a long, long wait. I had to find something to make me more like Henri. I'll have a look around. Maybe I'll find something. Yes, you do that. Very similitude is the key, Stobart. Ah, you have arrived at last. Please, make yourselves comfortable. We are just making some last-minute adjustments. Father Simeon, Nico. Hi, Josh. Welcome to the asylum. Let me guess. Nave is overjoyed we've solved the case and he's putting us up for an award. Mm, not quite. I told him about Shears and Madofsky. He says it's fantasy. But that's crazy! Tell me about it. So what do we do now? 
Carry on anyway. And nail Madovsky. What about Nave? Ignore him. And this charade? The reconstruction? Well, sooner it starts, sooner it's over. Josh, what on earth is that machine? It's Nave's baby. Supposedly, it's going to analyze the crime scene and tell us what happened. But we already know what happened. Sure we do, but Nave doesn't. Quiet, please! How can I concentrate with all this racket going on? Lane was right. Nave was an idiot. <laughs>